Okay, folks, this has been around for decades and it used to be popular at primary school. I don't know about high school, but I know at primary school it was popular, especially amongst uh, the Japanese girls. They love this brand of uh, stuff. Let's see how we go with this. It's not my cup of tea. I've never liked it, never will. I'm too old for that shit anyway. But you found it on pencil cases and erasers, I think erasers or rubbers used to get them. Um, very popular label for children in particular. Extremely popular. I've already done that. We're going colour into black and white. We're going to turn this image into a black and white image, even though it's in colour. I don't know how it's going to look, folks. Let's see how we go with it. It is... Hello Kitty. You all remember, folks, Hello Kitty? Yeah, I hate Hello Kitty. It's so fucking boring and cute. Yuck. I don't like it. Hello Kitty. Used to, but it was popular. That was the thing. It was so fucking popular among the Japanese girls, especially, if I remember correctly. Um, but yeah, they're just—it's just a crap, it's just bullshit. It just looks shit. I don't like cute things as a general rule. I don't like all that stuff. I don't like dolls. I don't like dresses or any of that sort of shit, folks. Um. Let's see how we go with this, folks. Yeah, this photocopy is getting old. I haven't ha I've had it for like a little over six years now, so it's getting it's getting to the stage where it, it might need replacing, and I haven't got that sort of money to spend on a new piece of equipment. Um, I don't think that the bank is going to give me yet another bank loan for it. So Channel 9 have got to hurry up the pace and start airing my material because I've, I've sunk so much money into it that really I it, feel, it, it almost feels like I've sunk money into this shit. M more money than I can fucking earn, it feels like. It feels like, folks. Uh, it feels like it. So, in other words, I've sunk a lot of money into it, folks. Had to make sacrifices with things. You know, I don't go out to movies or any of that sort of shit. I don't like movies anyway, folks. I find them boring. Fucking boring movies. I do. I find them boring. I don't have any interest in them anymore. I think in my life, art, life imitates art, folks. You know, I feel like this is a movie, what I'm in, what my life is like. It's like my life is doing that cliche thing called imitating art. So, you know, I'm not living like a so-called normal person. I don't... Oh, fuck that noise. This machine is getting old. I think it's tray one. I think tray one I may have to switch to tray two for at least. Because it sounds like Trey One's pickup rollers, pickup roller is having problems picking up the paper properly. Uh, yeah, could end up causing a paper jam. Uh, I don't know, folks. I'm not. My technical skills are, are no good. I used to have an aspiration from high school days of becoming a. Uh, a photocopier technician. Uh, I still would like to do that if I could, but my disability has a problem, causes it n me not to have the ability to learn all the theory I need to learn and to, and to put my, to work fast and efficiently without making errors and, you know, and tr my troubleshooting skills are absolutely shit. I never was good at troubleshooting, so don't quote me that I'm, don't think I'm write about pickup rollers it could be something else uh, I don't know folks but all I know is there is something happening to this uh, machine it sounds like a paper feed
problem with some of the script. Um, so yeah, I just gotta see it's it happening. It's just fucked up again. This is looking really nice. This worked out so far so good. Hello Kitty. <laughs> I hate Hello Kitty, folks, but I hate pat Cabbage Patch dolls. I hate all that sort of girly, girly, cutesy, cutesy stuff. I hate it, folks. I'm more of a... Um, I'm not a tomboy in that I like to be rough. I don't like rough games and rough sports, but I like... But in some ways, I am a tomboy because I like masculine things, like being able to fix photocopiers and I'm interested in electronics and computer programming and robotics and uh, all that sort of shit uh, so but I can't do those things but most of those things because I'm my disability prevents me from doing it I can't learn electronics uh, I can't uh, learn how to program a computer uh, it's really sad. I can't do those things. I get frustrated about them, folks. If I could, I would redesign the photocopier from scratch if I had my way. I'd design it all by myself. I'd learn all the necessary uh, things that I need to learn, like programming and design and all that sort of shit. And, yeah, that's what I'd like to do. They, I do believe uh, there will be... Um, one day they'll have technology to fix the broken brain parts that happened at birth when I had a cord around my neck and came out breech. So yeah, Elon Musk is working on his thing called Neuralink. That could, and, it, and it also there could be, um, I could, there'd be other options I'm sure down the track, but at the moment it looks like Neuralink is the um, closest thing we've got. Oh, there's some research in Australia that's happening as well, so I'm, Looking forward to that innovation. And that's come up looking really quite interesting. I think we can now call this demo quits.